Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change payment method on Google Play. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering how do you change your payment method here in Google Play. Well, it's fairly fairly easy here and uh, quite um uh, in this case easy, yeah. So in this case, the first thing that you want to do here is you want to go ahead and uh, basically access your browser. Now, if you're trying to pay via the Google Play or in this case, the Google Play app here and it's not using the correct account, there's a workaround that you can do. So again, you want to go ahead and open up your browser here and you want to go to play.google.com. Now in here, you need to log into the correct account that you want to use as a payment. Now in this case, you should be able to see a login button, but since I'm already logged in, this is what it's going to look like. Now, what we need to do here in play.google.com is we need to basically install the app that we want to, in this case, uh, do the purchase uh, for, by the way. Now, by the way, if you haven't uninstalled the app itself, you want to go ahead and exit this one and you want to go ahead and look for the app itself and maybe just press and hold on it and click on the uninstall or delete icon here. But once you've done that, you want to go ahead and go back here on the Google Play website on your browser. Now you want to search again, search for the uh, app that you want to uh, basically download. Let's go and choose this app here and you want to click on the install on more devices. Now, what we need to do here is we need to choose the correct device that we want to install this to. In this case, let's go and choose our devices here. In this case, there are going to be a lot of devices and maybe I want to use one of my uh, accounts or let's go and choose this mobile device here and let's go and click on install. Now from here, once you've done that, what we need to do is we just need to basically verify our account here and make sure that it is actually us. So it might ask you to do a fingerprint or face recognition or even enter your PIN if needed be. Now in this case, let's go and enter our details here and use our PIN and that should verify us. Now, once our account has been verified, it should actually start sending this into the actual Google Play Store, or in this case, the Google, um, the download section for our Google uh, Google Play Store account. So it should start, as you can see, it's now downloading. So we just need to wait for this to finish downloading. And once it is actually downloaded, we should be able to start accessing it. Let's go and look for our recent apps here. So if you don't see it, you could go ahead and let's go and select this one and view the app itself. So again in here and yeah, so in here we have the Lingo. Let's go and open it up. And what you need to do here is you just need to basically log in into your account. Let's go and choose our Google account here. And from here, you want to go ahead and choose the correct Google account when you log in. Let's go and choose our Google account. And once you've logged in, what you need to do is you just need to proceed with the payment section or start the payment again. And basically, you should be able to start using the payment method that you want to use for your Google account. Now, in this case, that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.